So what would happen if the sun suddenly turned into a black hole? Would the earth just go flying off into space? Would it get sucked into the black hole? Today I'm going to answer that question for you. But to do that we have to learn a little bit about gravity first. The first thing to remember is that everything has gravity. The earth and you have gravity. You pull on the earth with the same force that it pulls on you. Except you don't move the earth much because it's so big. It moves you a lot though. There's gravity everywhere. It's a force that permeates the entire universe. It's the most unique force in the universe. It only attracts, never repels. That being said though, you may be asking, well then how are astronauts weightless in space? In order to answer this, let's turn to NASA. NASA has a cool little game on their website that lets you shoot a cannonball in space. Let's say that you had a large cannon that you could shoot a really fast cannonball. So first, you shoot it around 10,000 miles an hour. It's really fast, and it'll eventually fall to the Earth. But then, let's say you shoot it around 12,000 miles an hour. It'll go further, but it'll still fall to the Earth. But if you shoot it just right at around 18,000 miles an hour, it'll fall, but it'll just keep falling and keep falling and keep falling around the Earth because it's moving just as fast as the Earth is curving away from it. This is called an orbit. And then if you shoot it too fast, it'll just fly off into space. Early on when the solar system was formed, the Earth was moving just at the right speed that it was falling around the sun. This is due to the gravity pull of the sun on the Earth. So if the sun were to suddenly become a black hole, it would still have the same mass because the mass doesn't change if it becomes a black hole. So it would still have the same amount of gravity. So the Earth would just continue to orbit around the black hole as if nothing happened. Sure, everything on Earth would freeze to death and everybody would die, but the Earth would continue on its normal path. A good example of this is our Milky Way galaxy. At the center of our Milky Way galaxy is a giant massive black hole that all the stars are orbiting around. We're not being sucked into the black hole, we're just orbiting around it. But in the end we know, because of the size of our sun, that it will likely end in a supernova and not a black hole. So remember, black holes don't suck. Hey, thanks for watching. I'll put a link to that NASA website so you can go shoot a space cannon also. And remember to subscribe if you haven't yet.